Good evening and welcome to Love on the Cross, a series of stories, prayers and meditations for these evenings of Lent. Today is Wednesday the 6th of March and our opening music was the hymn, O God of Abraham Praise. Tonight we seek your face and forsake our empty hours. Tonight we seek you above all things. Lord, let our memory provide no shelter for grievance against another. Lord, let our heart provide no harbour for hatred of another. Lord, let our tongue be no accomplice in the judgment of another. In the looming awfulness of your cross, our sins stand out like great stones. Strip from us what is not of you. Give us well-being of the soul. Amen. Amen. Come now to our first reading. And our first reading tonight takes the verses, the first two verses of the hymn, The God of Abraham Praise. The God of Abraham Praise, who reigns enthroned above, Ancient of everlasting days and God of love. To him uplift your voice, at whose supreme command from earth we rise and seek the joys at his right hand. The God who reigns on high, the great archangels sing and holy, holy, holy cry, almighty King who was and is the same, and evermore shall be. Eternal Father, great I am, we worship thee. Come now to our Bible reading, which comes from the 22nd <coughs> chapter of the Gospel <coughs> according to St Matthew. Some Sadducees came to Jesus saying, There is no resurrection. And they asked him a question, saying, Teacher, Moses said, If a man dies childless, his brother shall marry the widow and raise up children for his brother. Now, there were seven brothers among us. The first married and died childless, leaving the widow to his brother. The second did the same, so also the third, down to the seventh. Last of all, the woman herself died. In the resurrection then, whose wife of the seven will she be? For all of them had married her. Jesus answered them, You are wrong because you know neither the scriptures nor the power of God. For in the resurrection they neither marry nor are given in marriage, but are like angels in heaven. And as for the resurrection of the dead, have you not read what was said to you by God? I am the God of Abraham, the God of Isaac, and the God of Jacob. He is God of the dead, but of the living. He is God not of the dead, but of the living. And when the crowd heard it, they were astonished at his teaching. Thanks be to God. Now a prayer. Wisest King of all creation, we worship you, Eternal Father. Make us so fully aware of your greatness and love that our lives shall be full of faith. Amen. Amen. <clears throat> we join together now in praying the Lord's Prayer. Our Father, who, who art, art in heaven, heaven hallowed be thy name. name. Thy, thy kingdom come. come. Thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, 
as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power and the glory, for ever and ever. Amen. Amen. God of all wholeness, heal our hearts, that this Lent we may implore justice through our prayer. Stand in solidarity through our fasting and reach out through our giving. Send your life-giving power to revive the weary, restore the broken and renew the face of the earth. We ask this through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. You have framed the warp of our souls. At last we will rest in you. We give thanks for the gift of sleep. But also for the gift of struggle. Awake, Lord, may we watch with you. Asleep, may we rest in peace. Amen. Amen. 